Hello everybody! This video is about taking a screenshot of your computer or laptop in Windows or Mac OS. A screenshot is a picture of your computer's or laptop's screen taken with standard tools or with a special program. Hello friends! If you need to recover deleted data, view or restore removed browsing history, Hetman Software Products will help you. Follow the link in the description, download the necessary program for free, install it and analyze the disk. The utility will show you the data you can recover, so you will be able to view it or get it back. In our channel and blog you will find solutions to any problem, from installing an operating system or configuring it to fixing possible bugs and errors or optimizing mobile gadgets. Our specialists will answer any questions you ask in your comments under the videos or articles. Let's start with Microsoft Windows. In Windows operating systems there are several key combos for screenshots. The Print Screen button. When you press it, the system takes a picture of the entire screen and puts it into the clipboard. To save it, start any graphics editor, for example Paint. Press the key sequence Ctrl-V. It will paste the screenshot in Paint, and the only thing left to do will be to save it with a good name and in a proper format. The Win plus Print screen combo. When you press it, the system takes a picture of the entire screen and saves it automatically into the Pictures folder in your computer. The screenshot will be saved in PNG format. The Alt Print screen combo. Pressing this key combination takes a screenshot of the active window, I mean the window of the program you are currently working with, and puts it into the clipboard. Then open Paint. Press the Ctrl-V key shortcut and save the picture. By the way, there is a video on our channel describing top 10 hotkeys in Windows and browsers and how you can configure them or change them. I will give all the links in the description. In some Windows laptops, the Print Screen button can also work for other functions, for example as the Insert button. Such laptops usually have an additional functional key. Fn. If that is your case, press Print Screen plus Fn to take a screenshot and save it to clipboard. Alt Print Screen Fn to take a screenshot of the active window. In addition to standard key shortcuts, Windows can also use standard tools or third-party apps to take screenshots. For example, the built-in app Snipping Tool. To start it. Type Snipping Tool in the search window and click on it. The utility doesn't need any special settings. Click Mode to select the mode for screenshots. Create one by clicking on New. Select an area to take a screenshot and it will appear in the program's window. You can edit it with such tools as Pen, Highlighter or Eraser. Then save it by clicking on the Diskette Shaped button. Choosing among third-party apps for taking screenshots, I can recommend the one I'm using myself, Lightshot. It's free, and you will find the link to the official web page in the description. To install it, go to the Lightshot page and download it. By the way, this app is available for Windows and Mac OS as well. After installation, its icon will appear in the system tray. It will start together with the operating system and it will be assigned to the Print Screen button. That is, when you press Print Screen, the program window will open automatically, so you can select an area on your screen and take a picture. In the top left corner you will see the resolution of the selected area. In the menu on the right you will see tools for drawing and editing. You can add text if you want. In the menu below, you can see options to save, copy or print the selected area, or search a similar picture in Google. When you click the Save button, Lightshot will suggest you to choose a folder for saving the file in one of the formats – PNG, JPG or BMP.
Also, Lightshot can upload your screenshots to its server prntscrn.com, which is very useful if you need to send someone a picture. You can send a link, which can be opened in any browser. Just as Windows, macOS operating system also uses hotkeys to take screenshots, but it saves them to the desktop automatically, so you don't have to open a graphics editor to save the picture. The key shortcut CMD Shift 3. When you press it, the system takes a picture of the entire screen and saves it automatically to the desktop in the PNG format. The key shortcut CMD Shift 4. Pressing it will open the highlighting tool. You can select the area of the screen you need and take a screenshot of the selected area. The screenshot will be saved to the desktop as well. The key shortcut CMD Shift 4 Space. It might have been the most useful one of all. At first, press CMD Shift 4 to activate the highlighting tool. Then position it on the window of the app which you want to take a screenshot of and press the space button. The window will be highlighted in blue. Now left click and the system will take a screenshot of the selected window only. All pictures automatically receive names in the following format – screenshot, date, time, PNG. By the way, here is something that may be interesting for you. There is a video on our channel about installing macOS on Oracle VirtualBox in Windows. You will find the link in the description. Talking of third-party apps for taking screenshots in macOS, I can recommend the same Lightshot tool you can use with Windows. It's a convenient tool and it has got a good rating in App Store. That is all for now. I hope this video helps you in taking screenshots in your computers or laptops. Hit the like button below and subscribe to Hetman Software channel. Ask questions in your comments. Thank you for watching and good luck!